Bro, we're the Peacocks team. Jeez. What are you doing here? You know, I just come to pass by, so I can work the heavy bag. You know, I thought I'd do my third session of the day down at the Peacocks today. Stop, stop lying. You, you, you've come to see, you've come to see a couple of uh, future. Uh, <laughs> look at him. See the head of MTK. Just, so, uh, there's always. <laughs> there's always got stuff going yeah. on. You in, came, in my life. You came to look at uh, Zach Shelley and. Uh, Cody I've Davis, come, I've come to visit nobody. I've come just to work out. I'm just here, you know, to just do my bit for the community and go home, you know. So how does it feel now? Um, your monetary for the um, British and um, Josh, um, Joshua Bush Marshall is just um, vacated it. Yeah. Um, so you've got to have to face someone else and potentially could be. Um, Jack Chelly or Cody Davis? Yeah, the thing is, is that's what we've been mandatory for a while now. We're mm -hmm. waiting to make it happen. I uh, ain't been out for a few months now, but a lot of the light heavyweights that we thought could be possible opponents have been tied up. Um, it's all about a patient game now. I've put myself in a position where domestically I've been now ranked number one in line now for the British. All the boys, a couple boys ahead of me in the country have moved on to bigger things. So I'm now holding the flagship at number one for the British. So it's just about now getting a dance partner, someone to come, either be number two, and um, you know, we get it on. Uh, actually, a quick question. Um, yeah. Who do you think is going to win between his action and Cody Davis? Do you know what? To be honest, there's two fighters I haven't really watched um, yeah. much of. Yeah. Um, I think they was both, someone said it was both super middleweights, wasn't they? Yeah. Um, so I ain't really got a quick insight of what the fighters are like, but best of luck to the both of them. Man. And if the winner, you're happy to fight any of them for Look, the... I'm just here to get the British title. Yeah. Whoever so it may whoever. be, it may be. You know, okay. I've got to focus on me, yeah. and I'm here to pick up straps, and that's what it's all about, you know? You right, Zach? How you doing? Good. Good, man. So you guys might be facing each other as a British if if, so, if, if, so. if you if you win. <laughs> you know, inshallah, he's the next brother. Yeah, he's the next brother. Yeah. Yeah. The business, the business yeah. here. Yeah. We're trying to follow in his footsteps, trying to be champ. <laughs> well, we'll see in the future. Yeah. We'll see. I'm not that kind of joke. Nah, it's all good. It's all lovely. It's always respect for the sports and the other sportsmen in the games. Yeah. You know, we're here, we're ready, we're working. Well, all the best in there. I, see, I catch you up uh, when when they fi we finally know who you're gonna face. Yeah. How's training anyway? What are you good doing? as always, you know me, just staying active, staying ticking in the gym. You know, been pushing myself a bit hard at times in camp. Obviously, I'm always in the gym, so I've had a few days to rest, yeah. recuperate, and go again. You know. Is the um is the next fight definitely for the British? Or you Possibly. We got we got a meeting with the team. Yeah. You sit down and you see what they got lined up for us. Obviously, before those problems with the dance partners, yeah. not so if that's sorted. Obviously, I've also got to make a defence of my WBA. Yeah. Also, so we'll sit down and see what we got on the horizon. Okay. All right. I'm good to say that. Thanks, Greg. Always love. Yeah.